Spade Splendid males have been bred to have long caudal fins. These long, heavy fins make them slower swimmers than those with shorter fins. They also catch really easily in currents, making it harder for betas to swim in strong currents. As a male gets older, their tail gets longer. It's common for them to begin to trim their tails at this time. The shape of the caudal fin can vary between betas, and some shapes are more desirable among beta owners. Fail tail Crown tail Half moon Plaquette or placotte Double tail The anal fin aids in stability while swimming. The pectoral fin is in charge of turning and navigation. Commonly, pectoral fins are small, but sometimes they can be big. We call these elephant ears. Elephant ear betas have big pectoral fins that resemble the ears on an elephant. Some betas are bred to have these impressive elephant ears, but they are not always successful. When unsuccessful, only one side is an elephant ear and the other isn't. This can cause instability for the beta. The ventral or pelvic fin is used for steering. The operculum, otherwise known as the gill cover, covers the gills and protects them from injury. It also covers a membrane commonly known as the beard. When a male beta sees another beta, you will notice that they open up their gill covers and show off their beard. You may have heard this behavior called flaring. They may also spread their fins out and begin to beat their tail, which can appear like they're dancing. The same behavior is observed during mating. The mouth is used for eating and storing eggs when moving them to the bubble nest. They have sharp teeth used for chomping and chewing up foods such as mosquito larvae, bloodworms, brine shrimp, blackworms, and other foods. The placement of their mouth makes it easier for them to catch food at the surface of the water. Betas, like most fish, have monocular vision caused by their eyes being placed on opposite sides of their head. This means they can't see directly in front of them, but one eye sees independently from the other. Although it might be cool to see in two different directions at once, this placement gives them poor depth perception. Ever wonder why your beta may react startled when you flip the lights on? A beta's iris reacts really slow to changes in light, so sudden change will startle your beta. If he's in a room that doesn't get natural sunlight filtered in, it might be best to turn on your room light first before the tank light. That will make transitioning a little easier. Betas don't have eyelids, therefore do not blink. So when they're watching you, they're watching you. The dorsal fin is used for stability when swimming so they can swim in a straight line.